A Japanese company is working to build an elevator into space by the year 2050. Spending seven days confined in an elevator car with 29 other people may not sound like progress worth cheering about, but it just so happens that the lift in question is going to space. Obayashi Corporation, a large Japanese construction company, announced that they plan to have a working Earth to space station hoist completed by 2050. The idea of building such a machine isn't new and was first suggested in the 19th century by a Russian scientist. So, what's taken so long? Much of the delay has been due to the lack of cable material strong enough to do the job. Recent developments in carbon nanotubes have proven promising, and the researchers at Obayashi believe that by 2030 it'll be possible to fashion them into long ropes. The current record for cable length achieved with them is 3 centimeters. Advancements are already underway for several other aspects of the elevator as well. Each year, universities across Japan tackle current problems and present possible solutions. Given the enormity of the project and its vast technological demands, a spokesperson for the company said a great deal of international support and participation will be needed.